Hi and welcome back. Another bonus video today. I know this is very exciting. Today we're going to tackle the topic of adenovirus. The reason I bring it up is because this time of year we get a lot of phone calls for people requesting eye drops for pink eye. And adenovirus is one of the most common causes of pink eye, certainly during respiratory season. It essentially in most adults is just a cold, but it has the added bonus of pink eye running along with it. So when someone calls my office saying, hey doc, I think I have pink eye, can you send me some antibiotic drops? I want to delve a little more deeply because most of the time pink eye doesn't require antibiotic eye drops. Certainly, if people have respiratory symptoms along with it, cough, cold, congestion, maybe a low grade temp, then I tell them, this is classic adenovirus presentation. You don't need any medicine at all. In most cases, you just treat your symptoms and it goes away. The pink eye resolves with the rest of the cold symptoms. In some cases, people with suppressed immune systems, the very young or the very old, can go on to develop a more serious adenovirus infection requiring antiviral medications and sometimes hospitalization. So if you're not getting better, of course, let your doctor know. So if you have a cold and you think you were unlucky enough to also catch pink eye at the same time, you're kind of right, but kind of wrong. It's one and the same adenovirus. Grab some saline drops, grab some zinc lozenges or Zycam, drink plenty of fluids, keep an eye on it. 